welcome to my channel Furkanullah PhD. Before watching this video, please subscribe my channel by clicking on the subscribe button and click on the bell icon to get new notifications. Uh, in this video, I am going to uh, share with you about a test maker software uh, on the name of Schoolhouse Test. It is actually the name of the software. This uh, school test software is having almost 14 types of question you may design it so this is the very new software I have experienced in my life uh, where you may design and where you may develop a very flexible and varied question types of MCQs uh, fill in the blanks true and false long questions short questions question with different pictures you may design very easily like i am going to show you how many types of question types we may design in this very software the very first one is multiple choice question we uh, certainly use the ms word or any other software for designing and for creating for uh, developing MCQs but I don't think so that uh, 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 I personally uh, will use MS Word or any other uh, app for test making purpose from today and onward I will always use the test maker software of schoolhouse test because it is having multiple options and having uh, a variety of uh, uh, options in this very software so the different types of question you may design in the schoolhouse test is the multiple choice question like you are watching in the picture over here that you may very easily design multiple choice question in the schoolhouse test the second type of question you may design in the schoolhouse test is the checklist and you may check over here like uh, somewhere you have to check out an option in the MCQs so you may develop it through the schoolhouse test very easily the next type of question you may design in the schoolhouse test is the fill in the blanks that is very commonly and very widely used for the students while designing the tests so this is next this is a very uh, important element of a test uh, which is very easily designed by the schoolhouse test software the next one is the list like we provide number of uh, lists for a common question and you will have to pick a certain one so you may also develop list in the schoolhouse test list with prompts and this is the example you may also uh, type and you may also develop and design the order type of question like over here uh, in the picture it is depicted and reflected you may also design the matching question like over here you will have to uh, match and select between the two columns and that is very easily developed and designed by the schoolhouse test software so this software is having um, multiple options for designing and developing the school test for the students and this is another type of question that is uh, very easily designed by the schoolhouse test software and that is the statement like uh, you may see in the picture that we are having multiple options for a single statement like which of the following statement are true so you will have to select one of the given options another type of question you may easily type and develop another type of question you may design in the schoolhouse test is the table in the table form uh, here we provide different types of uh, tables uh, 
having columns and rows from where you have to select one in each row so this is another type of question you may design through this very software and this is the short answer type of question where you may uh, write a question for having uh, a, a short answer and it is very beautifully and very uh, dynamically and flexibly designed in the schoolhouse test software the long answer are sometimes required in the test so you may also design it very easily and i think the last one is the true false which is widely used in the test uh, so you may use this software for different types of uh, 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 questions in the test and the last one is the diagram you may also uh, give and provide a diagram for having a certain types of questions and the last one is the multiple part question like here it is mount everest is earth highest mountain above sea level so multiple parts are given that uh, how high is it this is the first option this is the second option so we can also design multiple part question in the schoolhouse test so these are almost 14 types of dreadful question you may design it in the schoolhouse test software now i want to show you that how to download uh, a registered schoolhouse test software for developing and designing different types of 14 questions so you may also download the free uh, multiple choice test maker but it will not uh, provide you the full functions and the full options so that's why you may you may download uh, the free uh, schoolhouse test software over here but i'm going to show you i'm going to teach you that how to download the registered schoolhouse test software so for this purpose go to this website get into pc.com and then write in the search bar after clicking on the software categories write in the search window schoolhouse test and click on the go so it will show you different types of version scroll down to the bottom where you will find the download option for this software so download the full setup file but keep in mind that you will be prompted later on for the password so that password for the vendor and compressed file of this schoolhouse test software is one two three so click on this download button the downloading process will start here we go to start downloading this software so here we have downloaded the software just click over it Uh, click on the setup file after installing this uh, software then go to fix and this is a crack file just copy this file to the installation directory like I go over here and I find the school house technologies open this file and just paste, paste uh, the crack file over here so I just uh, replace the file to so just click on this option this is not uh, copying correctly because I have already opened the school uh, house software so let me close it down and then I try again it will uh, paste successfully so after uh, 
uh, pasting the click file to the installation directory then click on the schoolhouse test 5 and now it will open and you will see that it has been successfully registered look click on the about option and you will find the registry values and